What's your next one? My second one, my second one, is, what the heck is that? What? Yo, I think my game's glitched out. What's up everybody? Welcome to the first episode of the Pokemon Gold and Silver Randomizer Cage Lock. Obviously, this series is going to be between uh, me, Ebot 300, and Grungy Games. What's up, Grungy Games? Hi. I, I, so, I, like, I like Pokemon in the B movie. Same. So, do you want to go ahead and uh, explain the rules for the series? Yes, I will explain the rules. As I drop my controller on the floor. Okay. That was, so, that was smooth. Here we go. The rules. According to all known laws of aviation, there is no way a bee should be able to fly. Oh, no! Wrong, wrong no, tab. No. Wrong tab. Oops. No so, bee movie. So, we have a little bit of a, a different rule variation, because this is not just a typical Nuzlocke series. This is a cage lock. So, the cage lock rules are you are only allowed to catch one Pokemon, and it has to be the first Pokemon on every route. The Pokemon HP... Pokemon's HP drops to zero. You have to release it. Well, we put it. I don't know if you release yours. I put mine in a box. Yeah, I put mine in a box too. And this is one of the bigger things. You cannot use TMs or held items on your Pokemon. Okay. You have to nickname all Pokemon. After each gym, there will be one cage match in Pokemon Showdown, and in the, and then I'll go to the cage match rules. Each player will send right. out one Pokemon. And each Pokemon on your team can only be sent into two cage matches. After two, it cannot be sent into any more cage matches. The loser... The so, losing, so, so, like, each ahead. Pokemon uh, can only be used twice in a cage match? Yes, if it's still alive. If it dies, of course, okay. it's in a cage match. But if, say, I catch, uh, right. say I catch, like, a Hitmonlee, and I use it in a cage match, and I were to beat you, I could use it in one more cage match against you. So, if a Pokemon dies in a cage match, would it, like, would it be dead dead, like a yep. Nuzlocke? Yep. Alright. That's the next rule. The losing player has to put away their, po their fainted Pokemon. And then... Alright. The winning player gets one of these three rewards, which I actually put on the layout, like, uh, they're above the Pokemon sprite. So, it, it looks okay. kind of cool. Um, you can either give them TM usage, a held item, or another life, a free revival. And All right. which is really nice if you have like a really strong Pokemon. And so how that will work is if I win, I can put a TM on and then I can send him in again and get held items. So if I have the hit on me, I can give him like a really good TM. Which, do you want to go over what you randomized? Um, I don't have it pulled up right now. Hold up, I'm going to pull it up. Okay. Okay, so what, we're what we randomized uh, are starters, wild Pokemon, and items. Trainers, TMs, move tutors, uh, if they're in the, uh, Are move tutors in this game? I don't know. I feel like they might be. I don't know. I could be wrong. Uh, no abilities because it's Gen 2. Uh, we randomize the static legendaries so that they're always a legendary, and the static normal so that they're normal. And we also randomize trades. Are you ready? So, like, are. Trades. You ready? Yep. You ready? All right, let's do it. New game. Okay, so I have a speed up button if we ever need to use it, like when we're hatching the Togepi egg. Uh, yeah. Or I have I, a uh, fast forward as well. Wait, yeah. should we set the time? I just set it to really whatever matter? default is. Cause it doesn't really matter. Okay, yeah. yeah, I'm just gonna do it. Cause it could, you could change the time on your computer if we have like an Umbreon, or, like an EV. That needs to up. Yeah. Ooh, I got a star me. It's my Professor Oak. Oh, I'm not there yet. Hold up. Oh, my Professor Oak was a poly, poly world. We both got water types. Yeah. That's a that's a sign that the randomizer's working, so we're good. Yeah. Imagine if one of us got randomized to get Chikorita, Totodile, and Cyndaquil. Dude, that'd be so weird. It would either be like a crazy coincidence, or like I didn't randomize it. And then like everything else is randomized. I'm not actually I'm not actually naming my uh, trainer Grungy. I'm naming it what I've been naming it in like every series lately. What? Ma Matty B. Wait, can you not do numbers? Uh you should be able to. I don't see them. Lower case? No. You can't do numbers. Okay. I don't think. 
All right, I'm just gonna do e bot. So okay. we're good. I'm in my room already. Yo. Look at this old fashioned computer. Hold up. Is there an item? I'm still talk. I'm still talking to Oak. Or rather, Oak's still talking to me. Okay, wait. Okay, I'm in my room. I'm in my room. Okay, there's nothing in the PC, by the way. There's nothing. In, there's nothing in the room at all. Like nothing in the PC. Okay. I actually. Oh, it's I, my mom. I was speeding up in my room. I'm sorry for that. I received the Pokemon. I'm gear. talking to my mom. I'm talking to my mom right now. I got the Poke Gear. Noise. It's Sunday apparently. I don't. I don't care what day it is. <laughs> I have no idea what day it is. Oh yeah, it's Sunday. Never mind. I'm just literally just spamming A right now. Me too. <laughs> I'm gonna change the text speed to fast if I didn't already do that. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna have to do that as well. Fast. Okay, wait, fast. Do you yeah. want let me let me change that as well. Do you have your uh, battle scenes on? Uh yeah. Okay, I'll keep it on. Should too. we keep them on? Okay, it yeah. may make the game go faster if we turn them off, because this game is kind of a slow pace. That's what I did during Gen 4, I turned them off. Alright. So, do we have to go- where do we have to go now? Just to... Uh, whatever his name is, Elm's Perhaps Lab, which is right- it's right next door. <clears throat> and then we get our okay. starters. Alright! Here we go! Watch me get like a Hello or Lugia. Okay, I'm talking to Elm right now. Me too. You can go first, what, was, what is your first starter? Let's go from left to right. Uh... I'm still talking- yeah, we'll do left to right, we'll do left to right. Like, you'll go, then I'll go, then you'll go all I'll give you a Pokemon for a partner. It's a rare Pokemon this time. Alright, I'm about to pick my starter. You ready? What's your first starter? So, first one is a Drowsy. Oh, that actually pretty good. My first one is a Persian. Okay. What's your next one? My second one, my second one is, what the heck is that? What? Yo, turn on your voice call and show me what it is. Yo, I think my game's glitched out. Uh, what is that? What does it say its name is? It... Uh, wait, it says... It says unknown. Oh, then it's an unknown. <laughs> Yo, oh, what the heck? Sprite just mean, must be messed up for it. That is really messed up, okay. My second um, one is... I, I'm not gonna take an unknown. Wait, you, your second one is a what? A gloom. Oof. Alright, my third one, my third one. My third one is gonna be... A, a Magikarp. I got a Quagsire. An unknown, an unknown, a Magikarp, and a Drowsy. Oh, I'm trying to think of who's better. Ooh. Are you kidding me? Quagsire or Persian for me? I don't know. Oh, this is kind of hard. Alright, I'm gonna pick the Drowsy, because that's the, obviously the best one out of the three. Because Unknown is, like, glitched out or something. I'm picking Quagsire. I think I already know what I'm gonna name All right. it to. Alright, I picked Drowsy. Okay, I picked Quagsire. Timestamp Matthew. Alright, here we go. Okay, mine's a female Quagsire, so we're gonna name you, um... I'm gonna name it, uh... It's a male Drowsy, I'm gonna name it... Oh, do you want to have the nicknames on the on the sprites? Uh, I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Yo, welcome we'll, to we'll the squad. We'll figure that out afterwards. Welcome to the squad, Lily the Quagsire. I named my drowsy Mud Boy. So do you want to go it's to Mr. So Pokemon? Or do you want to just end it here? Uh, end the episode here. Yeah, or do you want to go all the way to Mr. Pokemon? I don't know. We should go to Mr. Pokemon. Okay, my item- We're only like- We're only like 10 minutes of recording. Yeah, make sure that your okay. Pokemon isn't holding an item, because that's illegal, sir. Oh, shoot. I need to do that. Mine had a focus band. Alright. My Drowsy has a- <laughs> My Drowsy was holding TM23. Find out what that is, and then you could- If you beat me, which I don't know if you will, because Quagsire's- Quagsire's pretty good. Alright, wait. What? Oh, it's Sweet Kiss. Oh, like that's gonna be useful. Cause this confusion. Pretty I mean, oh, I actually know. Confusion in a cage match. Ooh, there's a Peach oh, in yeah. this first round. 
I want you to have this for your errand. I got a potion, noise. Imagine one of us leaves an item on and the like comments is like screaming at us. We still have an item on! <laughs> That's what we gotta make sure. Alright, so uh I just exited the lab. Where do I go now? Uh you go to the left. Okay. Yeah, I'm already on route one. I I know I'm I know my Johto. We don't have uh Pokeballs yet, do we? Nope, you we don't get them. You don't get them until after the first rival battle. You go all the way to Mr. Pokemon. The first the first patch of grass that I stepped in was a Voltorb. Nice. I found a level two Voltorb. That's My nice. first was a Pichu. Oh Yanma, that's not good in this gen. I mean, ooh, a bug. I'm gonna keep my Oh! Down. Stop stop encountering. If I catch I this Yanma. I found Yanma. a Flappy. I found a Flappy, I kinda wanna. But I can't I can't catch it yet, can I? Nope. We don't have Pokeball okay. If we would have right. had the first encounter, you would have caught the like, you would have been supposed to catch the yeah. Voltorb and be the Pichu. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna talk to this guy actually. You're gonna need a grass type to be able to take out my Quagsire. I know. I do need a grass type. Because if if you don't have a grass type, there's really I don't really have a weakness. So. Where am I supposed to go? So once you go to your left, um, from Route One, you'll like, hit. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is. Oh, wait, okay. You'll hit this town here, I forgot what it's called. It's Cherry Grove City. And then from Cherry Grove right. City, you'll go over to the left and then go up. And from there, it's Mr. Pokemon. Sorry if there's background noise, by the way. I don't know what's going on. It sounds lit. Yeah, okay, it's tough. Oh, wait, I got a berry from a tree. I thought there was a hit. Oh, there's a hidden item somewhere down here. Ooh, Stop a... encountering Pokemon. Oh, I found a- I found a Butterfree. I found a Scyther and a Pinsir in my first route. You know what those are? Those are bug types. You know what you have? A Psychic type. You know what Psychic is weak against? Bug but you didn't catch them, though. You don't have- you don't have balls. Not yet. I'm catching one. You won't catch it. You won't catch it. No balls. You won't. I'll catch it. Okay. Just wait and see. I'm gonna okay. catch it. You're probably- Finds Master wait, Ball. Wait, this guy- I found this old man. He said he could teach me something. I have no clue where you're at because I'm almost in Mr. Pokemon's house right now. I'm sorry. Oh no! I I actually went into the tutorial of like what everything is in the city. You know what you should do is just use your speed up button. Wait, what is that? Is that F10? Uh, I don't know. Mine. I have a controller and I have it linked to the left stick. I can cure poison. It's nice. It's like... I got the mystery egg from Mr. Pokemon. I know I'm way far ahead right. of you. Yeah, you are. It's not a versus though, so it's good. Yeah, if it was a versus, I would have already been like kicked out because I've sped up on accident like twice. Yeah. I'm just gonna like speed through this guy's tutorial. Literally speed whatever. through anything you need. Yeah. The only thing I would say we shouldn't speed up through is like gym battles and like rival battles. Oh, I got the map card. What is that? That just allows oh, you that, to get Oh, the it's map. just a map. Okay. Where'd you get that? Because I probably should grab that. It's it's the guy, the old man who, who like tutorials or whatever. So I'm in, I believe, Cherry Grove City right now? Yep, and from Cherry Grove, you'll go all the way up. Okay. Well, not, you'll have to make sure that you take the right route to it, like, not like, the actual route. But, uh, don't, make sure that you stay, stick to the right, and then go up and you'll make it to Mr. Pokemon. Okay. I think we can get our first couple encounters in on this episode, if you want. Alright. Yeah, we could, we could. So, you go up to the right, you said? Yeah, and you'll see a house, and it's Mr. Pokemon's house. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, okay, I, I think I found it. Yo, I wonder what our intro moment's gonna be, because I feel like it literally should just be the blooper of... Yeah, the unknown. Yeah, the unknown, for sure. And then in the background, you just have, like, the blooper. I found, I found a jump ball. Oh, that could cure- that could kill my, uh, Quagsire. Yeah, so wait, once we get- once we get Pokeballs, we can go back to, like, all the routes? Yep. 
And you get po I'm fighting the rival right now on action. I forgot where you fight him, but... You're fighting somebody? Yeah, the rival. Oh, Wait, I didn't even check the moves or anything on uh, Blood Boy. He has Pound and Hypnosis. Okay. I'm gonna Pound that, this jump up real quick. That could be easy for you to catch stuff with, with Hypnosis. Yeah, actually, let me run away, please. Thank you. I'm not trying to waste all my time in that battle. Oh, wait, I think I found Mr. Purple as well. I might, my Quagsire right, yep. might die. My Quagsire died, but it's not. Uh, I don't have Pokemon yet, so I'm not going to start. Yeah. I have a feeling I'm going to lose something. I'm going to sit here and uh, train up while I wait for you, because I don't want to lose Okay, something. I just, I just got the mystery egg. Okay, from there you're going to go back to the lab. Then you'll fight your right. rival in between. And then you get to name your rival. Okay. What'd you name your rival? I haven't named it yet. So I'm gonna name we it should name we should name our rivals Grenji and Evot. I have actually a pretty funny name. I'm we could do that. What is it? Or you name since you're on the left, you name yours B and I'll name my movie. Oh yeah, we have to do that. We have to. Pretty funny. Okay. I think Oak just gave me the Pokey though. Yo, Lily's level 8, she's crushing it. She's crushing the game right now. I don't know if she ever learns a move. So, all I got is water gun and kill it. <laughs> Let's check Pokemon in the database real quick. Alright, so... Let's go to Pokemon database. Alright, so... I'm making my way back to the lab. I dropped my controller. I found a Smeargle. Oh, that could be good because of Sketch. Wait. <laughs> Wait, its tail is red. Uh, turn is that... Is that, how is that how it's... Is that how it, how, is that how it normally is in uh, Gen 2? I can't remember. I feel like it is. Let me check, let me check Pokemon Dad. Oh, no. I mean, either way, I can't catch it because I don't have balls, so... Imagine it's a shiny. That would be the important Dude, method. but it didn't sparkle or anything, though, so... Yeah, and I think gold and silver have a really... Let me go to its... Uh, sprite. Yeah, okay, yeah, it's shiny. It. It's shiny in Gen 2 as it's normal in every other generation, so you're good. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't know why they did that. That's weird. That's kind of weird. I don't yeah. Know. I found a Kabuto. I found a Kabuto too. Interesting. There's so many choices to pick from. Yeah, but luckily, or not luckily, but with the randomizer, <coughs> or I mean with the Nuzlocke. Oh, I learned Earthquake with Quagsire at 35. Dang. You randomize the uh, learn set. Like, if I have a TM for like Flamethrower, Quagsire might have a chance to learn it, right? Wait, what did you say? If I get like a TM for flamethrow and I win a cage match, you, uh, wait a second, I think I just found it. No, I don't think I found it. Uh, but if, did you randomize the learn set? Did you randomize, did randomize the learn set? The learn set for TMs? Like if I have a quag, my quagsire, if it wins a cage match and I have a TM for flamethrower, does he have a chance to learn it? I uh, don't remember, honestly. We can always check. Oh, them. yo, my rival picked an unknown. That's so funny. What unknown was it? It's, I don't know, it's like, it's this one. Maybe, maybe, one it maybe that's why it messed up, because we didn't know what sprite to use, because it was, there was like 26 it's that one. Yeah, probably. Okay, I'm gonna it's head back to the lab now. Do you see it? Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know which one that is. Oh shoot, he's almost killed me. Yeah, my, my rival killed me, because Lily was only level 5. Yeah, exactly, I'm only level 5 too. I will unknown, train up dude. What the heck? You might want to train up your Lily, or not your Lily, your Mud Boy. My Mud Boy. My Mud Boy. <laughs> you might want to train up Mud Boy to like level 10 in between episodes because I trained up Lily to level 10. It's been yeah. But did I happen to get his name? I'm pretty sure he said, mumbled something about his name being Movie. Oh, yeah. Mine said something about like B. I don't know. There's no B Pokemon in Generation 1 and 2, it sucks, because I would Is there not? But... 
That does suck. I think there's only one B Pokemon, and that's Combi. And... Oh, I'm yeah, about to get. That's right? the queen. I don't know if I have Pokeballs in there. I may have already got. No, I don't have them yet. I'm about to get them all. Okay. Um. And then there's two rocks. I'm going. Goes... I think I'm going back to the lab. Oh, I gotta talk to Alma yeah. again. After you talk to the police officer and give your rival the name, you have to talk to Alma again. Okay, so you take the name. <clears throat> There's like three... We're at like 25 minutes, like we can get like three encounters. Yeah, we can do that. I don't know what the difference is between the, the routes though. Okay, so... The first route, route one, is right after you meet. Then you can go up. Yo, the catching tutorial had a Tyranitar. Oh, for real? Yeah, that's and okay, I'm naming my rival. I'm naming my rival right now. Okay. I'm gonna wait. Oh, dang it. I Did was you... gonna wait for my first encounter, but I just got it. Select Did the you bus. name your rival yet? Yeah, I named it Movie. Okay, good. So now I have to go... Where do I have to go? If you're gonna talk to uh, Professor Elm again. Oh, yeah, okay. Boom! Oh. Oh. Timestamp Matthew, you get that Electabuzz! You got an Electabuzz? Yep. Dang. I mean, he kind of looks like a bee, so we can name him Barry, because he's also electric type and the Flash. <laughs> got, like, we can name him Barry. Oh yeah, he's the Flash and Barry Benson from the Bee yeah. He's He's just like a fan fusion of both of them. I didn't even hit yeah, Barry. Yeah, exactly. He doesn't have an item. His moves are... Quick Attack, Leer, and Thunder Punch. Ooh. I can't wait so to see wait. what you're going to get. Wait, did I get... Did I get Pokeballs? You gotta talk to the aide after you talk to Professor Elm, and then you'll get Pokeballs. Oh, yeah, okay. And then I'll initiate the catching tutorial when you go to Route 1, and then I'll show All you right. a minute. From Route 1, if you go left until you have to go up, and you keep going up, you'll find a way that you can get to a route above. So let me find okay. it. I, I'm gonna All right, yeah, the, I'm doing the catching tutorial right now. I want to say, it's much better for me to have this Electabuzz than a Pichu ever. Yeah, true. Yo, imagine I get a Master Ball. Yo! Yo, the, um, the catching tutorial is a Kingdra. Nice. That's crazy. Tyranitar and Kingdra. His name is Dude, boy. Don't you really like Kingdra? Is that you or somebody else? Yeah. Uh, I think it was somebody else. Somebody put on, like, uh, like... On all the discords that's been going around, like the uh, yeah. favorite Pokemon every type. So I'm gonna put Dragon, Kingdra. Chansey is my next encounter, but I think I'm gonna kill it for experience, because Chansey's not very Okay. Alright. I'm on Route 29. That's what it's called, right? I believe so. Okay. Yeah, I'm about to get my first encounter. Let's see what it is. I'm so scared. Please be something good. Oh, it's a Voltorb. Okay. That's not right. bad. That's not, that's not terrible. Electro, Electro's extremely fast. My car go I'm fast! I'm pounding it. Okay. Please don't die. Okay, I'm moving. I'm gonna pound it again. I already have my first two encounters, and I killed my second encounter because it was a chancy. And right. I was like, it's not very good, and it gives a lot of experience. You did one damage to me. I got an Eevee as my next encounter. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, you almost just killed uh, my good sir Barry, and uh, that's not okay, Lily. I threw a Voltorb at a Voltorb, and I caught the Voltorb. I just caught an Eevee. Alright, I'm naming it... I'm naming it, um... Ball. <laughs> I just named it Ball. I have weird nicknames. My Eevee's name is Eugene. Eugene. <laughs> Eugene. Hey, anyone yeah. in the comments, if your name is Eugene, you, we need to like, we need, you need to let us know. Yeah, I'd, we'll evolve it into whatever evolution you want. Eugene Krabs. Eugene, Eugene's like, uh, I want it to stay Eevee. I'm like, no, that's no, no, no. Okay, wait. So I went, I went up and left off of that route. You went up and left. Okay, yeah. so you're gonna go up on route 
well, the first route that we get to, Route 29, I believe it is. Let me check my map card. I found so. another Butterfruit, but I'm pretty sure I'm on the same route. Where's my... I'm oh, pretty sure. Pokey Gear, map card. Okay, so on Route 29, yeah. if you go up a little bit, to the very top, you'll, and you look for, like, a where you would exit the route, you'll find another route where I caught, where I kept with my chance to, and I'll show you. Okay. I found, uh, I'm in New Bark Town right now. I just got to New Bark. Wait, where's New Bark? I feel like you may have actually... What? New Bark. Is that where the first Yeah, it's... I think? I don't know. It's the one where the catcher, or not the catcher tutorial, the, um, the old man with the map card was. Oh, you're in... Oh wait, do I have to go up on these hills? Or wait, no, wait where the old man was. Yeah. The old the man guy who gives you the map card. Yeah, he was in Cherry Grove. Go down oh, to Cherry Grove. Bro. And from Cherry Grove, go oh, right. Oh, okay. Go right, go to Route 29. <clears throat> and then follow the white path, then go up. Go up to the berry tree. Go to left, or right. Go down. Don't go completely down, but Wait. you see like a building. Wait, I'm confused. I'm, I'm lost. We knew this would happen. Yeah. He hasn't played Gen 2. I played a little bit of it, but not really. Okay. So I just opened okay. up the face. Oh wait, I know what I know what that building is. I know what that building is. Hold on. Then you go up, and then you'll get another encounter. They'll be in route. Okay, wait, wait. Right. Oh, oh, okay. All right. Route 46. Uh, all right, I'm where you are. I'm where you are. Route 46. What's your next encounter? So now I get another encounter here. Yeah. And then oh, you can man. get one to the north of Cherry I'm Grove. I'm What is it gonna be? Oh, I got a Dawn Fan. That could be very good against my Electabuzz. It could. I'm pounding it. Please don't kill. Okay, that didn't like do no damage. Did you get your encounter? So... No. Uh, so... The, the Professor's Aid gives you like five balls, right? Yeah, I'm gonna buy some more. If I have any money. Okay. Yeah, like so I, right now I have my Mud Boy, my Voltorb, and I'm about to catch this dog thing. And then did you get your oh, encounter? Oh, that's been a lot of damage. Did you get your encounter to the north of Cherry Grove? Like, uh, no, I didn't. Okay, Not so yet. after that, because we had to cut for a little bit, so we'll probably be around like 25 minutes in the final product. Hopefully. Uh, you have the intro, right? I sent you the intro, correct? Um, yeah. This intro moment for the unknown will be kind of funny. Yeah, that's gonna be pretty good. You should, like, have it Dude, this, this Dawn fan won't catch. You should have it to where your gameplay, like, is literally, like, it's only your gameplay and it like, shows you selecting the starter and it's, like, the unknown you. What is this? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. And I think I, ma yeah, I did make it, like, it fades in. So it'll look like Okay. I'm gonna hit hypnosis this time so. And after this episode, I'll Wait, for the intro moments, should we do it? Should we do the intro moments before the intro, or...? Yes, they go before the intro, like, and then you just fade okay. into the intro and then into the... That's how I've done it before, and I've seen YouTubers do it that way, like... Uh, that cage lock that I sent you, that is literally where I got the idea to do a cage lock. Like, I've watched a drive for years, and I watched his cage locks, but, like, with Munching Orange. Mm. And I, I liked them. But I definitely love the randomized cage locks and not like egg lock cage locks. Because Ajar right. does it differently. Like you have once you have a Pokemon in your party, you cannot switch it out until it dies. And I'm like, ah, uh, that's a little bit weird. Because yeah. if I have if I catch a, a magic carp and I accidentally leave it in my party, then I have that until it evolves into Gyarados and it's just a drag on my team. All right, timestamp. I just caught the Dawn fan. Let's go. Let's go. Pikachu or Eevee? That took way too long. Pikachu or Eevee? Yeah, you said let's go. Oh, no. oh uh, both. Yeah, which one actually has better exclusives? Wait, I have... Dude, I just realized something. Yeah. I have two mud elephants now. Dude. Because the drowsy is an elephant and it's named 
Mudboy. You should name it Mudboy I'm naming, too. I, no, I'm, yeah, I'm naming it Mud Girl because it's a female. Oh. I hope they're happy. Or should I do Mud Mud Lady? Mud Lady. You should do Mud Gal. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, there we go. Okay. Um. All right, I'm gonna go back up to Cherry Girl. Oh, wait, down to Cherry Girl. Never mind. I'm sending you a timestamp. Future Ebot, if you're seeing this, I'm gonna send you this thing through Discord, and it's gonna be a Don fan in a wedding dress, and then a drowsy in a tuxedo. And you should put that on the screen if you can do that. Because they're happy. They're happy together. Mud boy and mud gal. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> I'm gonna put that on screen, honestly. Wait, oh wait, this is my encounter, right? North from Cherry Grove? Yeah, what'd you get? It's a smear goal. Nice. So I can sketch something, right? Yeah, because if you get like, like hit with something. Oh, if you put that into a cage match after it went something good and like you give it a focus bash and then you sketch like a really good fighting type move, that could be deadly to like anything unless you're like. like wait, he sketched, he sketched my move. He sketched Pound. He should still have sketch unless. Oh no, when you catch it, it's gonna have power. It's not gonna have sketch until you. Oh it. my god. Until you no. learn it at level 11 again. No! That's so bad, dude. I'm still gonna catch it though. Wait, I just realized I, I only have like one ball. It doesn't. If this doesn't catch, I'm not gonna necessarily be mad. I can't believe I actually used pound on it. Like, I'm so stupid, dude. Okay, it broke free. I'm just gonna kill it. Okay. I don't even care. I don't even care anymore. I'm stopping where I'm at. Hands off the controller. Wait, my Mud Boy's almost dead. He's at like 2 HP. I didn't even- I wasn't even paying attention. Mud Boy dies at the end of the episode? No, we're, no, we're good. We're good. Okay, good. We're good. Okay, I'm gonna go heal up. That might be smart. I'm saving my yeah. game. Okay, so... Should we do the outro? Yeah. Which- Before right, you head it- Let me heal up my- let me heal up my mud boy, mud gal, and uh, ball. I have an idea. For the outro, like the actual outro of the video, should we replay the intro? And like have like the socials pop up, like the, the both of our channels, and like the. We could do like the, the end cards and stuff? Yeah, I'll, like, yeah. but we replay the All intro. Right. Alright. Should, should I cut that part out when we were just talking about that? Yeah, I'll, I'll timestamp it. Okay, cut that out okay. from like what we just said. I just that was for the timestamp. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go and do the outro. Right? Okay, you say it and then I'll say something because I have something really funny to say. Okay. So we hope you guys enjoyed this episode of uh, Gold and Silver Randomizer Cage Block. Uh, we got some interesting encounters this episode. I got two elephants, so that's pretty nice. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Anything else to say, Grungy? Yeah, and we may have forgotten to mention the schedule. Uh, we're gonna try. We're gonna try to do every Monday and Friday, right? I yep. Believe. Monday on my channel, Friday on Ebot's channel. Yeah. But this episode right. you're seeing on both, so make sure that you subscribe to us both so you can not miss any episodes. Yeah, subscribe to both of us. Yeah. All right. All right. I think that's um, where we're gonna wrap up. See you yeah. guys next time. Hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, we'll see you in the next episode. Peace.